guys and welcome back to this channel. I thought I'd do a iOS 14 customization tips and tricks. I know there's a lot going around on YouTube at the moment, but I thought I would upload mine as well as everyone's style is different. So today I thought I'd show you how I styled my phone and what apps that I use and a lot of other people use as well. Excuse my daughter's toy that randomly goes off. Um, so you download the app called Widget Smith and it's actually free. So they come in three different sizes. There's a small widget, medium and large. We'll do, we'll do a small one. So you click on add widget. You can do the time, dates and custom. So you can add just random little cute photos in. And we'll do, we'll do the date. Then you can choose your font, the color. So we'll do white, the background color. Obviously I'll go cream. And then you can have a border color. So I'll choose white. And at the very top where it says small and the number of it, you can actually rename it so it's easy for you to find which one you've just done. So we'll call it calendar, save, and then you go to your home screen. You can hold the screen to edit it. Hit the plus sign in the top left corner, add widget. So you gotta write in the app. We choose a small one, so we'll add that one. And you can move it around to where you want it. And if you want to edit it, you just hold on to the widget that you put there. You hit edit widget. And the one that we just put in will be easy to find because we named it. So calendar. And that is done. Now, I also learned something else just while accidentally playing through my phone. You can actually stack widgets on top of each other so you can scroll through them. I don't even remember how I did this, but we'll try to give it a go. So I'm pretty sure you add a widget, you can hit smart stack, or oh, actually, we'll add save clock, go add widget, and you can drag that widget straight on top to the one that we just did, and you let go of it, and it's on there, and you just scroll through, which is quite handy if you don't want like heaps of widgets on top of each other but you have a lot of things that you want to see or you want to show and now for the customization of the apps it actually took me quite a while to do so I was on my MacBook and I literally went on Google and found every single icon for all the apps that I use and I made them all transparent and then I went onto Pinterest and found a really cute photo that I wanted as the background so I could paste the icon on top of. So if we go into shortcuts, hit the plus button on the top right corner, you click on add action and scripting, then you hit open app and you choose the app that you want to do. So we'll go, we'll do Pinterest. Then you hit the three dots on the top right corner Add to home screen, rename it. So I'll name it Pinterest. And then the little icon that's right next to it, you click on that and then you can choose your photo that you want to paste as the icon. So mine's here. Oh wait, that's not it. Here it is. Click that and then you just hit add and you are done. It's quite simple like it's a bit confusing at first obviously but you'll get used to it so there it is on the top left corner you click on it and it's going to take you to shortcuts first before it takes you to the actual app so that just is going to add like one more second which which isn't too bad the only thing well the other thing i had noticed was that you don't actually get like a notification number on them like you know how on your original apps where if you've got a message on messenger you'll have number one on there so you can tell that you've actually got a message <laughs> a notification the customized apps don't do that but that's i mean that's not going to bother me i don't know if it could bother you but 
yeah so that's it for today if there's anything else you want to know about customizations or more tips or something just leave a comment and i'll get back to you i hope you enjoyed this video it's not something that i thought i would ever do so don't forget to like subscribe and hit that bell for notifications it goes a long way for us thank you Thank you.